your category is entirely made up of people from Succession and the White Lotus. Do you have any fighting words for the White Lotus guys? What's the message from Team Succession? I just think we take them. We're bigger guys. You know, Skarsgård and, and Matthew and me, we're just big. We're all hulking, you know, uh, re and ready to fight. All three of us are aggressive. Ruck, not sure, you know, if he's if he's that, but um, we'll take those guys. And hopefully we'll get a chance to at the HBO after party to, to really battle and, and wrestle. Now within the four of you, is there any sort of bet going, like whoever wins has to take the others out to dinner or buy them drinks? We don't have any bets going. You know, it's who I, I, I hope one of our guys wins. I'll celebrate the White Lotus guys if they win, but um, but I, you know, I just I love our guys. We're all very close at this point. Uh, you know, I know Matthew has the edge, um, and I think he's just one of the greatest actors I've ever worked with and greatest guys. So um, so if that's how it goes, then. I'll do whatever he wants. I'll chug anything. And that's, it, that's what you do when you lose a bet, chug something. Um, and finally, if you had to pitch a spinoff for Cousin Greg to Jesse Armstrong, what's the pitch? Wow. Uh, I guess like Greg entering politics. He gets a little sick of the corporate world. Doesn't really, he's not a very techie guy. I don't think he's very tech savvy and so maybe he thinks he'll get into the ring of, of politics and run for maybe he'll run run for like a local comptroller in New York and then slowly move his way up the ladder and um, please don't tell Jesse about this pitch this is very unfleshed out so